Wagwan Massive, I am Fziba. Welcome or welcome back to the channel. So today we have a different vibe. We're gonna be going downtown. Well, we're already downtown, but we're not reaching at the town center yet. So we're gonna be going to the market today to shop for some of the foods that I eat. We are going to see how much we can make the little money stretch. Like, um, we're gonna try to spend about five thousand dollars and see how much we can get out of the five thousand dollars and to see if we really can survive on a budget you know with a little five thousand dollars so let us just see what's going to happen all right so right here so we they know i think this is east king street east king street and you can see the place the dealer no deal is a bar and a chill spot and like right now the sun really turn up turn up turn up so when you come downtown one of the issues that you have is getting a parking spot um, the parking is really bad and most of the times persons just park in the no parking zones so to me it kind of better you take the taxi or the bus and come down but less problems for you if you take the the bus or the taxi all right so we'll find a parking spot and of course you know it's that it commandly um he might come for park because that's one of the things with them do them park here and then you know after a while they have to give them a little thing so everything yeah everything. we did kind of find a spot before him come on still yeah. all right so i guess him doing work so i forgot to pay him because <laughs> him park with successfully all right guys so we are going out into the town center now and going up into the busy market district as i say so of course the first thing I have to do, I have to pick up two market bags because of course I leave my market bag there this morning. So I have to pick up two market bags so that I can get the camera stuff in. All right, so these are the peas you want to buy, people. These are the local peas. You want them butter peas here? These are red peas. Yeah, we want to see red peas, but these are the local, local red peas, peas right? Yeah. So these are where you buy. This have life, yeah. and this you eat. Yeah. All right, so four hundred dollars for this. Yeah. All right, oh auntie. Give me one of the, the local um pine them. Make this way uh, make this way one pound. How much money that now? Uh, five twenty. Alright. One eight up for Irish and Black Cat. Irish are one sixty up for one sixty up for the Irish. One fifty up for the cabbage. Hundred to me to. Sixty for hundred. Two bills up for day two. Day two that two bills up. Grab a phone. Peach, local peach. 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 Alright, me take it. 
and corner this, corner this. Uh, 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 All right, so guys, I ended up spending more than I budgeted for. So in essence, my under budget, right? I spent about $7,500. So basically what the $7,500 got me, I got some Neesberry, guys, these sweet like sugar, um, sweet pepper, tomatoes, so one salad and the rest of it, tomatoes. I got some just one single chocha guys one single chocha because chocha is so expensive one hundred dollars for chocha I got me some cucumbers only two cucumbers um a little piece of yam and garlic beetroot two coconuts of course these are not native coconuts but it is what it is I got me some um dashin and some oranges, sweet potato, of course, ginger, and some turmeric. The squash, zucchini, I got some peach. This, this is a Jamaican local peach. See what this look like. Um, I got some turnip because turnips, you know, one of my favorite foods. Um, some local onion, rose apple, Sorrel, of course. Um, when I usually have sorrel this time of the year, so this is the agriculture sorrel that bear right throughout the year. Some celery. Um, this is uh, marjoram. So instead of thyme, I got some marjoram because yeah, marjoram have a lot more flavor than the thyme. So marjoram and skelly, a scallion. And guess what, guys? I got a uh, avocado or a pear, as you call it in Jamaica. Um, we don't normally have pear this time of the year and I was able to get this one for a hundred dollars I didn't buy a lot of these because of course it's not pear season I don't want to waste my money so I'm going to see how this one eat before you know we'll go back and buy any more and of course some scotch bonnet pepper some carrot and some local corn so yeah them are kind of tough but we prefer these compared to the um, sweet corn so basically guys, um, I don't know if they mentioned the Irish potato, but what I do some of the times is that the Irish potatoes, I try to buy it from different persons so that again, I get my correct weight. So this is like a pound and then I bought another two pounds. And I also have a little lettuce. It's not really lettuce season, so lettuce is very expensive. So I'm just buy a little piece here. And this peas. So as I was showing to you while I was purchasing, this is the Jamaican peas. And guys, this peas, when you plant it, it will grow compared to when you buy the peas that is imported. So let me just open it and make you see what it looks like. All right, so I forgot to shell out them here. So you know, so my fingernail are going to get dirtier. Um, so yeah, so this is what the Jamaican local peas look like. And uh, guys, these cook in 10 minutes or you can literally just eat them as is. So that's it guys, that is it.